Okay, so here we're going to talk a little bit about glycolysis. And in specific, we're going to talk about the emden mayer hoff pathway, which is the most common pathway found in uh, major groups of microorganisms, plants, and animals. It also functions in the presence or the absence of oxygen. And its uh, main goal is to provide precursor metabolites such as NADH and ATP, which will serve as energy for the cell. So um, this pathway begins with a six carbon glucose molecule, which gets phosphorylated by an ATP. This phosphorylation yields a glucose six phosphate. Um, number of uh, isomerization enzymes work on this pathway and isomerize the glucose 6-phosphate to fructose 6-phosphate. This fructose 6-phosphate is then later phosphorylated to yield a uh, fructose 1,6-bisphosphate. This um, pathway then later on takes a turn to um, energy creation when fructose 1,6-phosphate is split into two 3-carbon molecules, okay? So um, this uh, fructose 1,6-phosphate is readily converted to a glyceraldehyde 3-phosphate. This glyceraldehyde 3-phosphate is oxidized and we see that NAD plus acts as the electron acceptor. Um, later on a phosphate is simultaneously incorporated to give a high energy molecule called 1,3-bisphosphoglycerate. These reactions are what set the stage for the production of um, ATP. The, for the phosphate on the first carbon of 1,3-bisphosphate, bisphosphate glycerate is donated to ATP to produce ATP. This right here is an example of substrate level phosphorylation. Um, but as we see that the overall end result of this pathway is the creation of net count of 2 ATP but not only that, it is the catabolism of glucose to pyruvate. It is also very important to know, and I will repeat often, a reducing agent is an element or compound that loses an electron. So here, the glyceraldehyde 3-phosphate was the reducing agent. And with that, I will leave it at this. Okay, an oxidant, okay, an oxidant gains electrons, okay? Basically, the oxidant was reduced, okay? And then the reductant lost electrons, the reductant was oxidized. It's a little confusing, but you'll get the hang of it.